Renewable Diesel has caught the interest of researchers and experts. In 2015, they got together to exchange ideas at the 4th HVO Experience Day in Needigan. You know, I cannot really tell what the future will bring. There's so many effects that there are. But from a technical standpoint, I can say that if you develop new fuels, this will also be a, a catalyst for new engine development. So if you can bring a good fuel, a perfect fuel, together with an adapted engine, this will be beneficial for both sides. And in the end, it will be beneficial for the customer. Well, uh, I'm coming from uh, a major oil company. I was working there for 25 years. I was, I would say, in the top management. I cancelled my job there just to work with uh, an XBTL. We formed up a company, I formed up a company, and uh, I, I would say I believe a little bit into HEO. <laughs> yeah, put it that way. Um, what we can see from the market, the price is a bit higher than standard fuels. But at the end of the day, there is a strong political will um, to, to, to find other solutions than standard fossil fuels at the end of the day. The potential itself, I see much more in um, very specific uh, purposes and, 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 and applications to, to develop the whole strengths of HVOs, or I see it as a blending component um, in, in stand diesel, in road fuels, uh, in heating fuels, in this respect. I think that, that as, I, as I said, uh, you should strive for uh, drop-in type biofuels. So uh, it's much easier to get fuels on the market if they are fully compatible with the existing infrastructure and with the existing vehicles. Mm, I see. And, and here uh, HVO type fuels have a clear benefit. I think that uh, currently if you make a biofuel it is more expensive than fossil fuels. Then when you are producing a biofuel you should take care that the quality is at least as good or even better if it's superior to the fossil fuel it's replacing. And here I think NextBTL is a beautiful technology because you have, uh, you have a, a, a flexibility for, for the raw material and you always end up with a fu fully fungible drop-in type high quality fuel. I think it makes sense.